Hi, I'm Peter Kalmström of Kalmström.com Business Solutions. In this demonstration, I will talk to you about the checkout feature. That's available on all libraries, document libraries, page libraries, and the forms libraries, all kinds of libraries has that feature. It protects the documents or the files against unwanted edits. This document is not checked out, doesn't have a checked out icon on it, so now anybody can edit that file. If I want to reserve it for me or check it out for me, I'll do that either here, and it'll drop down there, and under more, I'll check out this file, or I can also do it by selecting the file and then go into the ellipsis up here, and there's the checkout. You'll notice now that I get this little icon here, which um, points down, showing that it's checked out to me. Now, if I log in as Antonio, you'll see that that is indeed checked out to Peter Kalmström. And if Antonio now tries to open this file, it will say that the Word Online cannot edit this document. So that is the protection. Now, if I go back as myself and I edit that document, and of course I can do that, everything's fine because it is checked out to me. And now I can do an edit, just color everything yellow. That would be very nice. And then I'll go back and that is indeed saved that change now a few seconds ago. However, it is a very common mistake to forget to check this document in again. So it will stay checked out. Yeah, but you have to do that by going into the ellipsis again under more and check in. Or again, you can do it in the toolbar up here also and check in it. Color yellow like that. And now you see anybody can edit that file. You can also go into the library settings and under versioning settings, you can say that this requires that document be checked out before they can be edited. So if you're having problems with people editing the same document at the same time and uh, causing problems that way, then you might want to enable this. But I've seen a lot of customers enabling this feature everywhere by default and that creates a lot of problems with forgotten checkouts so that people lock their documents without checking them in again so that's an issue also so that's something that you need to evaluate which causes more problems unwanted edits which are of course visible in the version history or forgotten checkouts so that's the problem i've seen more of the latter more problems with habitually uh, requiring checkout everywhere and having problems. So that concludes my demonstration. Thank you for watching.